be told read this. <laughs> We didn't go far enough over. We started wrong spot. How do you start at wrong well, spot? Well, it starts in the park. Flood level. Yeah. Is that feet? Eighty nine is the top one, June something eighty nine. Then you got good grief, that's seventy eight feet. Wow. That's quite a quite a height. <laughs> oh yeah. The bridge was built by Masters and Mullen Construction Company of Cleveland, Ohio. Victory Bridge it was an important link on America's first coast-to-coast -to -coast tourist route called the Old Spanish Trail. Cool. Something buzzed under my foot. <laughs> National Highway. It's commemorated earlier colonial roads and linked San Francisco, California, and Jacksonville, Florida. Some invasion of Spanish Florida was the key factor in forcing 1821 transfer to Florida, the United States. Its original appearance was that of a flat-topped pyramid. We already read this. Hills weren't for battle. The hills were for where they lived to look the, scout the area. But I don't know if this is one of seven, I guess. Oh, I see. The other's down there. So this would be where they lived. What? It's the Aplachicula. River with a seven arch bridge, and they had a. Well, I think I video. They had a drawbridge type thing where they let the river boats go through, and they took out that when they built the new I 90 or Highway 90. And then over there's the rest of that bridge and the boat ramp. And this is the trail. Well, we gotta go down and do the trail. That's the boardwalk. It's supposed to go around this park where the Scott Massacre and the fort and all that, but it's falling apart so they block it off. But the squirrels can sure go it. Now there's another boardwalk over here it was another mound well, you didn't take a picture of what it said uh, did it give it instructions on the numbers there's one here Five and six. Seven, eight, seven. okay this should be seven This is Higgins Ferry Park in Clanton, Alabama. Love the country. 
beautiful, beautiful. No, quiet in the morning. It's seven o'clock. Um, we were in Eastern, which would have made it eight, but seven o'clock. Hearing all kinds of weird noises. Birds, hogs sound like dogs were chasing hogs. Well, ago down there. That's the boat ramp. We'll go up there later. This is the campground. There's only supposed to be what, 25 sites. And we're on site 5, which is perfect. The fee is $30 a night. You get 5% off if you're um, senior. Which is not bad. We paid hundred and twenty four for four nights. They said the deer we didn't see nothing last night, but they said the deer come down into that grassy area, eat at night and early morning. And that's up by five thirty. Didn't see nothing then. But I think our site, good site, a lot of pine trees, nice area, very quiet, but I love the quietness and then the birds and noises of the boat ramp. A lot of people go up the boat ramp early, early. I mean, there was cars going up there at 5.30 this morning, and noisy trucks, but not, we're far enough away. Is it better? And I like love our side. We'll walk today. There's some other campgrounds, or it's still part of this one over there. That white building, there's a tornado shelter. They had tornadoes come through a week ago, or a few days ago. Knocked out some houses away from us. But again, Love the pines, quiet, sycamores, all different kinds. Listen to the birds. This again is uh, Higgins Ferry Park Campground. Showers there. And they got a tornado shelter, but we're supposed to have bad weather uh, tomorrow and Sunday. This is Friday. Friday the 9th of April. Anyway, the shower building looks like that's where I'd probably go. Now we've got... Oh, well, that's the trash. Okay. Where where the trash was. And... Lake. Need to go up there and look at the campsites up there, but... Oh. I wanted to walk down here and see what the lake look like. It's kind of long and skinny on the map. But we'll take a look. Very nice playground for the kids. And that's where our host, our park ranger, he lives there. They built him that house and he gets to stay there for free. Oh, that's pretty nice. And they got a pavilion. Read what else the marine is down around the corner. We'll see maybe if that's it. Kept up nice. That's the marina. Uh, Lake uh, Mitchell. Uh, I think this is, yeah, there it is. Mitchell. There's another lake across the way. That's regulation. So I have to read it. Ooh, you can catch turtles. Yuck. I hear thunder, but I hope it's gone. 
far enough away, I hope. This is one busy place for boats. Got boats and trailers, boat coming in. Nice thing over there, I'll have to walk over there and see. Pretty. little lake. Hills of Alabama. private residence or not. Looks like it might be. I thought it was a marina. Nice little gazebo. And a boat dock. Not a dock, but a boat storage place. Kind of cool. And it goes on down here. Let's see if I can see past the corner. Around the bend. Uh, no, pretty flowers. Must be people's houses, and then they've got their own boat dock out on the lake. That's supposed to be the swimming area. That's rotten. Looks like rain coming up, foggy or something. I don't hear the thunder anymore. Very nice. Small, I think there's only 65 sites. I would stay here again. $30 a night, full hookups. But it's pretty in the fall with the trees turning. Okay. Uh, gonna be a, one of those little hard climbers. But we'll see if we make it. I wanted to show the pathway up here. It's really nice. For the picnic area. There. Very nice. Nice walking path. I guess this goes back up to the other campground, there's two or three loops. Our loop is one to ten, sighting up. And the others are two more. I think I filmed it on the map. This is, oh, there's one, 11. This is the, oh, I don't know what number, 11 through something. Most of these people look like they are here. Sorry for the pen. Just come up a hill. But they look like they're permanents or monthly or something like that. And then there's the lake out the, down the hill. Yeah, I think the little trees that are blooming now, like that. I think those are dogwoods, but I'll have to look them up. And that's the driveway that goes to the house that I thought was a marina. Maybe not. Woods, thick woods. The Confederate Army had to march through here. Civil War business down the street. I'm hoping to go to it, but we're supposed to have severe th storms. Yuck. That vine going up the tree is wisteria and it's blooming, starting to bloom. Cool. Yeah. Look at this. Look at these roots on that thing. That one. Boy, it just wants to hang on. Not sure what that is. Bentley Brothers, or Bentley Boys, 1923. 
And it says it's Highway 711. But that goes down and who knows? It's supposed to be a county road. Glad we didn't take it. Now, go up here and back down to the camera. This is the tornado shelter that if we have to come a running tomorrow, supposed to have severe storms, then we'd come here. And it's starting to sprinkle on me, so I'm going to have to head back. Either, either end. Must go downstairs, down below ground. But, that's the parking lot. And we are over there. I'll video some more. I'm getting closer. That's the campground. Only 10 spaces, so pretty good and quiet. We've got space number five. And, yeah, pretty good and quiet. There's our spot on the end with this view across the road. I thought that might be a spring. Oh, been feeding the squirrels. They've already found us. So, good deal. <laughs>